Let's go to Dave Malkoff. He's in Worcester, Mass., just west of the Boston area to talk more about that. And Dave, uh, the kids love it. But the adults, I was just talking to someone the other day who was like, I have burned all my vacation days, essentially, with these freaking snow days because I had to stay home with the kids. It really affects the entire community, Stephanie. We are piling on here. We've got these fluffy ice crystals on top, but then there is very heavy snow underneath it. Not only is it piling on with the snow, but it's also piling on with these snow days for everyone. There's only so much Worcester Public Schools can plow before they throw up their hands and call it a snow day. This drive is the perfect example. South High School is way up on the top of the hill, and then there's the school grounds itself. It's already piled high from the last storm. And here comes another. Facilities manager Tom Barrett behind the wheel there says a snow day is just safer for everyone. Of course, they had a lot of them so far. <laughs> There's been eight so far this school year for Jahir Lawrence, his buddies next door, and his mom. Because they have to make up all the snow days. Or we could use one of our breaks. We're not sure at this time. In a town like Worcester, snow is the mother of invention. It's been a lot of work. Jahir's mom works at a nursing home, so her boss, an ex-limo driver, actually comes and picks everyone up. And also my niece works there. So he was able to come out, pick about five or six of us up with, with clothes, extra clothes. And Jahir just ends up staying next door with his friends. I'm staying home mom. And I just, I get cabin fever really bad myself. I think it's fun for them, but a pain for us. There is a way to get rid of snow days altogether. And it could only come from the mind of a 13-year-old. Only if buses came like monster trucks could just plow right through the snow and bring kids right to school because I don't really like missing school days. Yeah, nobody likes missing school days when it's going to take chunks out of your summer or spring vacation, Al. I believe somewhere in a body shop, somewhere around here, someone is building that yellow school bus with the giant <laughs> monster truck wheels. Maybe here, maybe in the city of Boston where they definitely need it. I hear you've got the superintendent on the line right now. Yeah, we absolutely do, Dave. Thank you so much. Uh, with school closed again tomorrow, I think now you've burned through all your snow days, correct? Yeah, burn is the right word here, Al. And we'd love one of those monster school buses, but we're at eight days now, 